So we will start with uh, small uh, phrases, you know, okay. a greeting and how to start, you know, to say hi and how are you. Mm -hmm. So the first word I think you need to know is uh, how to say hi in Arabic, mm -hmm. which is marhaba. Marhaba. So marhaba means like, you know, hello. So if you want to say hi to someone in the Middle East, you start by marhaba. So now the writing of marhaba is a uh, you know ra in the middle, mm -hmm. and Spanish r, so it's like an English r. So marhaba. If you noticed, there is a pause between you know the first syllable mar, and then ha ba. Now the third letter ha is it might be a bit difficult for students because it doesn't exist in any language except Arabic. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so if you can repeat later for me, ha, ha, exactly. So it's coming from the throat. So uh, you could say it's double H, you know, ha. Yeah. So these two notes I think is important for this word. Marhaba. Marhaba. Mm -hmm. Marhaba. Exactly. Is it is that, that is letter, it is it? That's yeah, this letter. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So this is okay. ha. Yeah. For now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna like uh, you're gonna write in phonetics way, and then I'm gonna use the most important letters for the first in the sessions. So, for example, this the letter ha. Important to know the shape and how to pronounce it. So marhaba. Now the respond of marhaba is there's many way like many ways you can respond by. The most maybe common one is ahlin. So ahlin. So if I start by marhaba, you will say ahlin. Marhaba. Ahlin. Exactly. <coughs> now there is difference between the ha in ahlin and the ha in marhaba. So the ha in ahlin just like normal h. So ha, ahlin. So you don't need to exert any efforts. Mm -hmm. So where marhaba. It doesn't need to, like, you know, feel it more. Mm -hmm. So, if you said hello. Marhaba. Mar marhaba. 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 And you will respond by? Ahlin. Again? Ahlin. 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 Yeah, ahlin. Even softer than ha. It's normal ha. Ahlin. Exactly. And make it, uh, <coughs> make the ya is more extended. So, ahlin. Ahlin. Even even more. Ahlin. Yes, it's the right. So it's the ya, it's a. You have a sound. So ahlin. Even some accents that really go really long. So ahlin. But yeah, so it's better to ex exaggerate it now. So when you hear it, you, you won't get surprised. <laughs> so if you could write marhaba, you know, phonetically, the way you hear it for now. Okay. Marhaba. Mm -hmm. And then you have Ahlin. Yeah, Ahlin. Marhaba, Ahlin. This is the Ha, Marha. And then the this normal H. As well, if you could write the letter Ha, how yeah. it's written. This is Ha. And then the ha, how is it written? So ha, this is, so it's uh, yeah. So again, marhaba ahlin. There is a second response for marhaba, which is uh, marhabtin. Marhabtin. Do you know the I meaning? Know that one it's uh, two marhabas. Okay. So when you add to the marhaba you have dual okay so marhaba marhabtin marhaba ahlin you could choose there's like m loads of you know responses for marhaba so yeah marhabtin 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 okay Okay, now if I want to say how are you, so 
to say how is kif. So kif means how. If I want to address a male, how are you, I have to add suffixes. You know suffixes, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So uh, the suffix for you masculine always ak. So ak. And for feminine is ik. So always you have a suffix for you masculine ak and you feminine ik. Now, if I want to say how are you, what I'm going to do, I'm going to just join Keith with the suffix I'm looking, I'm looking for. So, how are you for a masculine? Keefak. Exactly. Keefak. And how are you for a female? Keefik. Exactly. So, Keefak, Keefik. This rule, the suffixes, you know, the ak and ik, I will use it for every noun. So with nouns, if you have nouns, mm -hmm. always you could use that. I will give you another example. House in Arabic, bet. So your house. Betak. Exactly, and your house for a female. Betik. Mm -hmm. Another example. Uh, na like name in Arabic means ism. So your name ismak. Ismak. Your name what is it? Ismik. Mm -hmm. So you understand the rule? Yeah. Okay. Now go back to the first idea. So how are you means kifak or kifik. It depends. The respond of that or as well it has you know loads of ways. Mm -hmm. The easiest way you could say tamam. Tamam. Tamam means like I'm alright. So kifak tamam. So it's well understood everywhere and people use it in any Arab country. So tamam. Tamam. What's um, Bikhair? Bikhair. Bikhair as well as uh, good. Another, yeah, I'm well. I'm well. Like uh, Bikhair, yeah. Okay. So Kifak, I could say Tamam. I could respond by Bikhair, like I'm, you know, well. I could say Alhamdulillah. Mm -hmm. So thanks. Yeah. 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 Alhamdulillah. <coughs> So, you could join as well Tamam with Alhamdulillah. Most people they do that. You could join Bikhair, Alhamdulillah. So, Kifak, how do you respond? Tamam, Alhamdulillah. Tamam, Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Exactly. Kifak, uh, Alhamdulillah. Mm -hmm. Kifak. Alhamdulillah. 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 Exactly. So alham, the first syllable. Du, the second. And then lillah, the third. With a ha on the end. Yeah, alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Ha. So three syllables. You know, in Arabic, when we speak, we speak in a syllable as well. Mm -hmm. But, like, no one you know, observe this. So always the word divide at least three pieces. But because you speak very quickly, so you don't notice. You don't notice that. So you see, al ham du lilla. So there's a kind of you know waving language. It's not like you know, in English or Finnish or Norwegians, they have like you know one accent at the beginning, and then you have to like you know say it straight away, without you know stopping or making mm -hmm. pauses. In Arabic, if you want to have a good accent, you have to watch the pauses, you know, the syllables. So, kifak, tamam, alhamdulillah. Kifak, bikhir, alhamdulillah. There is another one called uh, I'm good, which is im nih. Im nih. So, I am good. Good. Im nih. So, im. 
منيح So yeah. the the last letter in منيح is the ح this one exactly so منيح كيفك منيح كيفك منيح yeah منيح منيح in Alhamdulillah yeah it's like the same H at the end it's at the end at the start it's and this yeah it's the and at the end it's Tama Buta or Alhamdulillah it's just a ح just a ح just the this one the normal one so the first one the double H is the just the normal H in English. Okay. So how do you say hello? Uh Marhaba. Marhaba. How do you respond? Yeah. Um No Marhaba Ahlin. Oh Ahlin. Ahlin. Or or Marhabtin. Mahabtin. Okay. Again. Marhaba. Mahabtin. Mm-hmm. How are you? Uh, Kifak. Um, Tamam. Mm -hmm. Thanks, God. Can you say Tamam? Alhamdulillah. Tamam. Alhamd. Alhamdulillah. Allah. Okay. So, marhaba. Um, ahlin. Kifak. Um, Tamam. Alhamdulillah. Marhaba. Abtin. Marhabtin. 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 Kifak. Um, Tamam. Mm -hmm. Alhamdulillah. Tamam. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Now, so I said the name in Arabic means Ism. Ism. And your name for Ism. Ism. and for girl? Ism. Tamam. So to say what in Arabic means shu. So shu means what? So now, if I want to say, what's your name, you will respond, or you will translate that, Shu Ismak, and for a female, Shu Ismak, and now if I want to say my name, I have to use, I have to change the suffix here. And the suffix for I or my is E, always. So my name is S me. S me, my name. So your name is Mac, and for a female is Mick, and for I my name is me. So what's your name? Uh, you want me to say what's your name? Yeah. Shu is Mac. Shu is Ismak. And my name? Um, it's me. Mm -hmm. Michael. Exactly. Ask him what's your name? Shu is Mac. It's me, Alex. Mm -hmm. Okay. You have a question? Uh, I was just wondering what the, the S in. Is that an ordinary S? Yes, S, yeah. The S in. Yeah. yeah. S, the normal English one. Yeah, okay, fine. Yeah. If you want to see how it's written in Arabic, this is one. This. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now let's restart again. So, marhaba. Marhabtain. Kifak. Tamam. Alhamdulillah. Shu ismak. Ismi Alex. Marhaba. Ahlin. 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 Kifak. Tamam. Alhamdulillah. Mm -hmm. Shu is Mac. It's me, Michael. Mm -hmm. Any questions so far? Okay. Gotcha. Okay, now to say where in Arabic, when. So when means where. So, yeah. When, probably like this way. Mm -hmm. When. When. Mm -hmm. And from means min. Min. Okay. Now I'm going to talk about the pronouns. So to say I, I will use Anna. Anna means I. 
to say you masculine I will use in the in the so this kind of in the in the mm -hmm. in the and now you feminine I will use in t exactly e in t in t so in t and in t okay again so to say where Wayne. where Wayne. to say from Men. and to say I Anna. and you masculine in in t and you feminine in t so where where are you from? Anna no, where are you from? How do you translate? Oh. Uh, Wayne in T. I would say uh, Wayne, Wayne, Min, Min. Min Wayne in T. This is the easiest way. Min okay. Wayne in T. Like literally, from where are you? Min Wayne in T. Min Wayne in T. Now they respond Anna Min London. So, min wen in te? Anna min London. Mm -hmm. Min wen in te? Anna min London. Okay. So, again, let's restart. Marhaba. Uh, Marhab tena. Kifak. Uh, tamam. Alhamdulillah. Shu ismak? Ismi Alex. Min wen in te? Anna min London. Mm -hmm. Marhaba. Marhab tin. Kifak. Uh, tamam. Alhamdulillah. Uh, shu ismak. Uh, ismi. Mm -hmm. um, I forgot my name. Ismi. Ismi. My name. Oh, ismi Michael. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Min Wayne Inte. Uh, Anna Min London. Okay. So, ask him. Any questions? <coughs> um. Yes. <laughs> Got them now. Um. Marhaba. So, mm -hmm. Uh. Martin. Uh, uh, how are you? Yeah. Um, key. Kif Kifak. Kif Kifak. Mm. Uh, tamam. Alhamdulillah. Mm -hmm. Shu Ismak. Yeah. It's me, Alex. And the last one. Where are, are you from? Yeah. Min. Wayne, Wayne, Min, Min Wayne, Min Wayne, you, Inte, Min Wayne, Inte, and I'm in London. Your turn. Marhaba, Marhaba, Mar, Marhaba. Yes, Marhaba. Uh, Kifak. Um, Tamam. Alhamdulillah. Uh, Shu Ismak. It's me, Michael. Uh. Min Wayne Inte. Anna Min London. Okay. Any question? No. Okay. I'm sure to memory sucks. <laughs> <laughs>